I love Chicago in the winter. The city has a totally different energy to it. And with the right coat, you can experience the town with no one else around. Our favorite place is the park. From there, you can forget you're in one of the busiest cities in the world. Just a short walk from the bird sanctuary and you arrive at the harbor, one of the best views in the Midwest. It couldn't be more romantic. This morning, we woke up early to go on a walk and I got some great shots of her. I wanted to make something special. First, I opened up Photoshop Mix and created a new project. From there, I loaded up my background image as my first layer. Next, I added a second layer. I browsed Adobe stock images right from the app and found a cute picture of a bird. I could add more images as layers, but for now, I'm gonna stick with this little guy. Now it's time to cut out the bird from the background. I tapped on the cutout tool and selected subtract mode so I can zoom in to figure out just what to remove. Then with my smart selection tool, I scrub my finger to remove everything I don't want. Once it's time to get a little bit more detail, we zoom into the area around the hearts and I trace my finger around the white. The smart selection tool does the rest of the work for me. To clean up the selection area around the legs, I use the basic selection tool and paint in what I need. From here I clicked on the view on layers button. This way I could see what my composite actually looks like on the background. I pinched in with my fingers, resizing the bird and rotating it at the same time. Next I went back to my cutout tool, clicked on my basic selection and filled in the area of the feet. I was amazed at just how detailed I was able to get. When you zoom in you can really go pixel by pixel. From there the composite's done. I clicked on the share tool and hit save to Lightroom. From here I can go to Lightroom for mobile and desktop. Next I wanted to make some color adjustments to my image. So I opened Lightroom for mobile and because I synced it my image was waiting for me there. I clicked on the adjust tab and added a little bit of contrast. From there I brought my shadows a little bit brighter. We brought my whites a little bit brighter as well. And then I brought my vibrance up to give it a little bit more pop. Making that nice blue sky. Then I clicked on a color preset, punching those colors up even more. This really made the image stand out. Next, I wanted to make something really special. So I opened up Lightroom on my computer. I clicked on my collections and went to From Lightroom Mobile. It's waiting for me right there. For a little bit more adjustments, I went to my Develop tab, brought up my shadows, my clarity, and even brought the color temperature a little bit warmer. I set the margin on the top to 6 inches, pushing the image all the way down to the bottom and hit print. The card came out perfect. I knew she would love it. Best morning date ever.